hope this one will hit. So I came out y'all today to get my little walk in real quick. It's a little late night walk before it get dark. Which is getting dark now. Around this time it get dark at like 7. If it was summertime it would be around like 9, 30, maybe 10. Which is still cool. I mean, but it's cool that it's back at this time. But it's starting to get a little cold now outside. If y'all live in Michigan, then y'all know what I'm talking about. But if y'all don't, then let me explain. Um, Michigan weather change up all the time. One minute it's hot, one minute it's cold. I mean, look at me, y'all. Hoodie and a jacket at the same time. So that is show. But then this motherfucker's out here just walking without. Let me show y'all. You, if you can see down there, them motherfuckers down there ain't got no coats on. They walking with t-shirts. They just out here. But that's weather that make you think like that. But with me, I'm, I hate being cold. I hate being cold and I hate getting cold. I hate getting sick. I hate having to be sick. Hey, how's it going? Doing pretty good. Thank you. Well, yep. I want to highlight y'all. And chop it up with y'all real quick. Who's seen that boring ass Halloween movie? That Halloween movie was shitty. Um, I mean it was okay, but it wasn't expected. That movie was shitty. I didn't see like nothing that made me feel well, okay, I did see one thing that had me feel like the movie was it was tight for that moment. Um and that's when Lori was fighting with Mike. And they was fighting and he was banging her through the windows and the glass and shit. If you notice, when she got banged through the glass, though, she had no cuts on her face or none of that shit. It was just really weird. I was really surprised. I was like, seriously? Where's the cuts? Um, She had no bruises. Uh, She wasn't hurt really like that. She just kept got, getting up and fighting and she ended up killing a nigga. But, uh... That shit just wasn't what I expected. A lot of people um, may have seen it. A lot of people may have not liked it too. But I honestly see why it was uh, not a good movie. If y'all haven't seen it, I've seen it. I went and I watched it. Um, it's not worth going to pay and see. It's definitely not worth buying a premiere on Peacock. I mean, unless you just want to see it. Then you could check it out. But... If you want my opinion, my opinion about the movie or seeing it, if you're a person out there and you're like, man, I want to see it, but I want to know what somebody else thinks first. I'm going to tell you, don't waste your time. Wait till you can see it for free. I'm sure it'll be, what, maybe a couple days, maybe a month, and you'll be able to see it for free. But don't waste your time to go pay for that movie because it's not worth paying. You ain't going to do nothing to be upset. The storyline was BS. I mean, I just don't like how they bring a, no, a, a whole another dude in it. They bring a whole another dude in it, and uh, his name is Corey. And they bring him in it to be like a person to help Mike Myers. Now, when have they ever did some shit like that? They finally got somebody to come help him kill. Like it was the weirdest shit, and then they was fighting. He was fighting Mike and shit, and pushing him, and Mike was pushing him, and throwing him around and shit. But he never tried to kill him until like the end. And I believe like when he tried to kill him towards the end, it was more like a ritual thing. Like it was a ritual kill. Like he going to be coming back as the killer. He's going to be like the new Halloween killer, I believe. Um, Which will be understandable if that happened to me. I think that would be cool if they did some shit like that. Um, Because Halloween could continue. A lot of people got their pumpkins out, y'all. Got them cut up. They just sitting on a porch. Cut them goddamn things. Cut your pump shit. You ain't gonna be able to keep them forever. Sorry about the viewing shit, y'all. I'm outside at nighttime. Like I said, it's gonna get dark. Y'all got to see. It kind of change a little bit. But around this time, it get dark. Ooh, I started to see somebody has at Keisha's. Nope. Ain't nobody at Keisha's. Uh. But yeah, this is the time it get dark. My black about went out. But yeah, this is the time it get dark and uh it still look good when it's dark out here. I'm in small little I'm in a small little old city. 
It ain't no big city. It ain't no, you know, city that turn up all the time. It's this this is a little old independent small city that people just retire in, I think. To me it's a retirement city. Cause it ain't shit to do. Like Ain't even no friends you can get out this in this bitch and kick it with. I mean, everybody. I mean, I'm not going to say everybody, but I'm just going to say shit is just funny acting out here. I mean, shit is fake here. A lot of people ain't for the other person. Ain't nobody trying to see nobody else win. Everybody want to win and have their own shit. So it's just like really weird at points and at some time. So that's the reason why a lot of people ain't really out here hanging and shit. It's just, I don't know, it's just weird to me. A bunch of the times. What's up with you, bro? Yeah. Most of the times it is, and then most of the times it ain't. So, you know, it's just like, what the hell? It's backwards here, backwards there. So we all trying to figure it out in Kalamazoo, but I plan on leaving pretty soon. My leave time is probably, I mean, I just be walking past people, and shit just be seeming weird. So, you know, this dude just stopped. But I did see a bus stop. So I hope that's where he was stopping at. But then I was also hoping that he wasn't going to follow. I'm trying to take my phone because I ain't trying to fight nobody right now. And then that's another thing you got to worry about down here. Stupid people that do stupid shit. There's a lot of people that do stupid shit. I can say we the high rate city of uh, shootings and killings. I can say that. But you wouldn't even expect that in this little ass city. But then all the people who come here is people that come from Chicago in harbor uh just a lot of places that they come from you know what i'm saying so people down here that come and do this shit it ain't us that's doing it who grown who grew up and was living here it's people from different cities motherfuckers talk about they being the hood and all this kind of stuff like we did that already we was in the hood we kicked it in the hood the hood ain't the hood no more we played it out we didn't done it y'all niggas coming here and y'all niggas enjoying it like it's, you know, it's new to y'all. To us, that shit ain't new to us. To us, that shit old as a bitch. We go for it for a minute, but that's all we get. You know, we played it out. We was done with that shit in 2010, 2011. Motherfuckers still doing it like now. I'm like, man, go sit down. But our little hood, though, is really quiet, though. The south side really ain't like how it used to be. The south side didn't quiet up like a mug. I think, uh, I can't even remember the last time the South Side did something. The main stuff that we do now under this park, and we'll be at this park hooping, and it ain't just like the grown ups, it's, you know, the grown ups and the kids, you know, and it's not like, it ain't like the street or the hood kids or none of that crap. It's mainly just, you know, let me show you how to park some more. It's mainly just the neutral people who just out here and they just neutral, you know, and it's just they show love for the community and stuff like that. So it ain't really no hardcore people that be out here no more. And it really was never no hardcore people then, but up a lot of people in jail. A lot of people dead. A lot of people gone. So it's just different now. Kalamazoo ain't like how Kalamazoo used to be. Kalamazoo used to be fun as a bitch. Yep, I said it, y'all. I didn't mean to tell y'all where I was at because I don't want nobody coming looking for me trying to kill me and shit, but you know, I'm just playing. I don't think nobody would kill me, but that's just in general, you know. I'm just telling y'all that the city ain't the city no more. You get your few people that's out here, walk around and kick it here and there, but that's it. I think the north side still pretty much do what the north side do. And the east side, and all the east side neutral as hell, the east side quiet as a bitch too. Uh... East side ain't even like how it used to be. Everything just pretty much quiet. So, you know, we are still pretty much waiting for it to get better. My brothers never want to hang out today. They talking about, let's hang. Let's do this. It ain't nothing to really do like it used to be. Back then, it used to be tight, but it ain't tight like it used to be. See if Jennifer see me. Because I'm on my thing. I told her I was going to be YouTubing. What up, guys? Y'all getting y'all game in? I right, get it in, man. Yeah. Not on me. Uh, nope, not on my phone. I'm, I'm YouTube, and so I ain't got nothing but my YouTube phone. Y'all be smooth. Next time I walk by, if, I mean, or tomorrow maybe, 
I'll throw y'all a little something. Yep. Yeah, but then, you know what? Text me your cash app. You got my number, don't you? All right. Get it from your mom. All right. It's my nephew, y'all. He asking for some dollars. I do owe up. I owe up. Cause last time we was at the park, I was supposed to go get them some juice and some chips and all that kind of crazy stuff. But I end up walking off and not getting him anything. But you know how it is when you don't feel like buying no kids nothing. Hey, how's it going? How you doing? doing pretty good. I didn't feel like buying no kids nothing at the time. They was outside playing. They was kicking and cooling. Kids, y'all kids, go sit down somewhere and uh, play at the park with all that. All day, all night. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't buying no kids nothing that day. I was cooling. Wouldn't bring nothing back. I had walked off. Went to the store. I was doing my own thing. Doing my own thing. But people, what I do, what I do like about, uh, you know, the zoo, people still try to get out and still try to hang, even if it's just two of y'all. We're going to figure it out. We'll get a drink and we'll walk. Nobody really drive like that here. People drive, of course, but if you're really trying to get a good hangout in, you're going to just walk, shit. Fuck it. Get drunk and walk and kick it with whoever you with, your compadre. I know I only got like one or two people I hang out with. I don't really hang with a lot of people, and during do, when I do hang with a lot of people, it ain't really people that's my friend. It's just people that my friends didn't be around. I'm good. I don't need no friends and shit. Man, it's cool. I'm just story timing it up with y'all. I think it's cool as hell. Yeah, because I really fuck with y'all. Y'all my peoples. Y'all my family. Y'all my new fam. So I want to just keep it, keep it up with y'all. Keep contact with y'all. Let y'all know what's going on. Let y'all know what it is. Let y'all see my neck of the woods. It's just getting darker and darker. Y'all can't even see me no more. It's quiet on this street. See this street called. Let me find a sign. Damn, they ain't even got no sign up. Oh yeah, they do. Let y'all see what this street is called. Eggleston and Fair. That's the street. It's cool to walk down. This one's pretty clean. It's not nasty over here. It's not the hood. You know what I'm saying? My mom stayed down that way. And I stay down that way. Um, I stay more in the hood. We party over here at Keisha House, but ain't nobody outside over there. But you can understand why they not, because it's cold. It's cold outside. Nobody about to be outside, but they usually party too. But they must got something else going on, because right now, this normally the time they be kicking it. Who we'll pass here. I think Jordan him over here. I feel like I heard his voice. Mm-hmm. We know when we see the truck. Yep, cooling like a villain. Is that Jordan up there? Oh, J Rock. I'm YouTubing. What up, cuz? Oh, yeah, that yada ended up being him. yesterday morning talking to a blue car? Yes, I was. That was me. And yeah, I'm just YouTubing. Let me hold on, let me show you off real quick. What up, what up, what up? Yeah, what up, what up, what up? Hey, y'all. Well, damn, they can't see us. It's the end of it. I'm gonna get back with y'all, and y'all just be smooth. Till next time.